Y95 need fame and my whole hood knows me GBMB Records, Bubba Ray My nigga, Cripset music all day long It's I, it's I Hang tight with my Peckham crew My Peckham crew SC15 You know when we talk it's flames, nothing but Don't know Don't know my people, I've got a big nine five, yeah I want to adjust a few things right now, still, you get me? But anyway, what, you see this TikTok thing, yeah? Challenges on the TikTok, like the blackout challenge, yeah? I'm having this killed couple youths and thing, yeah? Now, what I've got to say to the parents and the man them and the sisters them right now, how can we be letting these apps control our kids right now? We need to get more control of our youths, do you understand? What's going on in our kids' life? Because I'm just seeing their TikTok challenges hurting our kids, doing more destruction than this, than this, than this, bossing them. Couple kids bust off this thing, but at what cost though? That's what we gotta look at now. How can mutes be dying off the blackout challenge? You understand what I'm saying? I'm not feeling that at all. So I gotta bring that to the light and let people know these apps can't be running our youth's life. Yeah, it's there to make peas or it's there to do certain things for us, but we gotta use it to our advantage, not make it a disadvantage to us. Do you understand that? And that's what I see a lot of men doing and a lot of parents letting their kids just let this TikTok thing just corrupt their youth's life, you understand, or create. Look at the create challenge. TikTok, what sort of challenges is this like? You gotta look at the thing and say the thing's just mad all in all, innit? But what I gotta say now, next thing I wanna touch on as well, you get me? I see my brother Tiny, the ghetto you must have done a little thing about my thing, yeah? And obviously I see the thing pop up, yeah? And I'm like, raw, got to man behind the scenes, cause I didn't know what angle it was at first, innit? But obviously we spoke behind the scenes and what I gotta say about that is, listen, whatever man, yeah, is on what I'm on, rebuilding and gaining order, do you understand? I don't care what a man's going through their thing, if they come around a table and they're on that thing there, then we're willing to listen to that, innit? Yeah, and I rate man for bigging up my thing, car. behind the scenes we've spoken, you know what it is, you get me? Man know what it is, big up your thing for bigging up my thing, yeah, right now, I don't care about whatever man's got going on, yeah? If man's talking about order, yeah, and man's willing to sit around a table, yeah, with generals, then that's what we do, we sit around a table, innit? And we reason, innit? And we see how we're going to make things better for our youth, them, innit? And our generation of kids, innit? Do you understand what I'm saying? Because you see even certain things in this music game and in certain games, remember, I don't rap in it. But like right now, it comes to me like you need money to, to money over supersedes talent. Are you nuts? That could never happen. Yeah, that should never happen. Money should never supersede a man's talent. But that's what I'm seeing now because a man's got money to rap. Or because a man's got money, he's the hardest. Or because a man's got this, he's the hardest. But the fuck all that. We don't care about that, innit? I don't care about what you got or who you are, makes you not a minute. Do you understand? Talent supersedes that for me and my people. When we look at someone, we want to say, right, that brother's talented, you know. He deserves his thing. It's all about deserving, innit? When you see a man deserve a thing, you think, yeah, a man deserves that because his talent made him deserve that. You get me? Don't know what it is. So on them levels there, we can't be making money or whatever a man's got, yeah, supersede the talent out there. And that's the problem, innit? We can't be doing that. You don't know. Big 9-5, we always keep them real facts, you know, yeah. Real facts out there, but hey, what I'm saying as well, next thing I gotta say, yeah, I see Blueface, yeah, scrapping up with his gal, and you get me, the gal's smacking him up, and you get me, he's licking the gal down, and I'm saying to the brothers, if you're in relationships like that, brother, it's toxic, innit? Get the fuck out of them relationships, yeah, real men don't find themselves in them relationships, do you understand that? Yeah, you walk away, my brother, yeah, so for all the man that's going through certain things, toxic relationship on the roadside, arguing with your gal and doing the most, like doing the maddest on the roadside, hear what I'm saying, brother? G check yourself, innit? And say, hear what I gotta do. I gotta fix up my thing, innit? I can't be acting like this on the roadside. My gal don't even respect me if I'm moving like that. Do you understand? She can't respect you if she's moving like that on the roadside or you're, you're out and... You, it's a mad thing, innit? There's no respect there, innit? There always has to be respect. Remember, in everything there's respect. In the way I live my life, I don't, if I don't see respect, yeah, then it's dead, I can never contact with you. There has to be a level of respect and communication. Do you understand that? Big man thing, you get me? Big nine five, but I'm gonna say again, yeah, tiny. Big up your thing for, you get me? Big up my thing. And what I gotta say as well, you know, like, he's told me a couple of my people got on, man, like, yo, like, my man's from Pepper, don't say nothing. So big up my people as well, my followers, that, and my man, them, you get me? That always got my back out here, innit? And like, you get me? And as you know, man's a real man, so we always come across and do everything as a real man, innit? So you get me, but big up my people that kind of sent their messages, you get me, but man know what time it is, you get me, we're all, it's all family, yeah, we're done, no big knife, eh?